be doing a bunch of these misfall quests because I have been slacking on them like a pig. Actually, I don't think pigs slack, but I, I, I don't know. Oh yeah, and Julia is here, obviously. I don't know where Maddie is. She's just being emo somewhere. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why emo, but these tracks don't look like any of the ranger horses tracks. How how would I know that? I'm such a dodo, I don't even know what to do. <laughs> Literally look at the tracks in front of me. And I'm like, where do I go? Oh oh come on man. Oh bird. <laughs> oh come on man! Oh bird. <laughs> These tracks don't look like any of the ranger horses tracks. I already said that. Let's follow him. I hope that was a glitch. The Lignos. I feel like that name sounds too weird for a beautiful creature like that. Like a Lignos. I don't know what happened. Oh, I'm just following this majestic creature and I'm not suspicious about it. Then again, I'm a soul rider, so I don't think I really care. Oh, I skipped it. I think he wants me to help him. Yeah, I think so. It's alive! What? What do you mean it's alive? I think he wants me to help him. I know! <laughs> it keeps saying, like, help him, help him! Whoa! What am I doing? Am I putting some sort of, like, powder down? What's happening? Salt! Stay away, demons! Oh, I use my magic. I didn't know I could do that. Oh, it's so Everyone's having network errors like me. Winnie. Winnie Valley? I feel like I've already been here. Oh wait, no, I haven't. I you got, got some, some boards. boards. I got some boards. <laughs> I got some boards, I got some boards, I got some boards. Uh, no, I do martial arts. <gasps> <laughs> it's oh, so a Rosemary. Oh my god, it looks like Flora! It's Flora as a baby! Oh. Sorry about oh. that. Well, my manners, I'm Rosemary, and these little ones are sapling and sprout. Oh! Welcome to Wild Woods. These parts are my are home to the three wild herds. Long ago, we used to be one, but generations of bickering divided us. Now we live separately with our own distinct cr cultures and beliefs. <laughs> Me and the foals are part of the forester herd. Oh, this is what people keep talking about. Thank you for the warm welcome. Gah! The squirrel talks? Hold on a second, you're not a squirrel, are you? You're not a squirrel, you're a, a... A human! What's a human? A hairless squirrel without tail, by the look of it. <laughs> Sorry for our shock, we don't get many of your kind out here. We were all starting to think you were a mythical being. With gangly legs and pointy five hoods and three heads. Okay, I don't have three heads, I hope. I have three heads, I hope. Wait, I hope? I, I know I don't have three heads. I hope I don't have three heads, guys. Sap- Wait, sorry. Sapling! That's no way to greet a visitor! Sapling, that's- that's no way to speak to a visitor. The foals are still learning their manners, as you can tell. It's fine, they're babies. What is your name? I'm Annabelle, and this is Snow Rose. Well, it's lovely to meet you, Snow Rose and Annabelle. And you can even understand us. You must be like the old bearded one. You mean meteor? You must have traveled here all the way from the gray world. You know, outside the wild woods, I have a friend who went there once, wandering the endless gray rock paths, surrounded by towering blocks. Sounds like an interesting place to go. Yeah, it also is a horrible place to go, so I'd rather just stay in these woods, please. I don't want to go back to the horrible... Today we've been collecting and learning about the pretty flowers in the entire forest. <laughs> we certainly have been, Petal, but I've told you before, you've got to stop eating the flowers. <sighs> anyway, across the water is a tally top village where the three herds and live and trade in rel relative harmony. I can't speak. When can I? Wait, Squirrel, walk, watch out! <laughs> what do we have here? A saddle broken and it's human? You lot would go well. <laughs> You lot would do well to go back to your sta stables and chew on dry grass. Here we rule without reins, you've been warned. Oh, I'm sorry. I should be assuming people's genders over here. She's a part of the warriors and the hood can still be a little cold to newcomers. I'm sure she'll come around. 
Yeah, Ash and her hood are bullies, always tromping on our flower beds with their silly races. Oh, I'm enjoying this quest. Enjoying this quest. I love by going oh, inside of the horse. <laughs> I love this quest so much, y'all. <laughs> As the horse is literally poking through my skin. Hey. Have fun meeting some more of us. Come back to us when you're done. <gasps> I love this. It's like a gazebo. <laughs> oh, look at this. It's Darko. Oh, it's Spa Keeper. Oh, dear. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. No! <laughs> what was it? to the right place <laughs> welcome to the polished hoof spa founded owned and managed by yours truly spa keeper is my name <laughs> back to your treatment that would be a you're hoof a soak followed by a very cheap condition you're a very annoying spa keeper <laughs> and seeing as you're new around here i'll let you in on a deal you can have the vip packages Thank for a total of three no. flowers instead of six what do you say? Ready to hop into that mood bath? <laughs> mood <laughs> bath? Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Wait, what? That was me saying it. <laughs> well, it was nice speaking to you, but my paying customers must get their hot stone massages now. Good luck with everything. Why did you say it like that? <laughs> I'm gonna give this one a... Like a... Applejack voice. A shiny new oh face God, in the ancient field. What? <laughs> People are really trying to get me to buy all this stuff. I'm just gonna say that because a shiny new face in the ancient Ooh. woods. Now Welcome. Fancy a bowl of twig and a leaf tea. I don't know what I'm doing. Crap apples, the name. It's hard to tell, but I'm the oldest member of the herd. I know. I look good for my age. Oh, you do. Well, you're a horse, so. Though it does have a few Ooh. gray spots. Is there anything you'd like to know about the foresters? Um, what do uh, they do? Why? The, the only thing there is to do. Enjoy the beauty of wild woods. <laughs> oh, I love this one! Juniper? My ear. Sorry. It's exploded. A lonesome traveler and their human companion. Come to greet Juniper. I wish you the humblest of welcome, Snow Rose and Annabelle. And what a beautiful... Beautiful, wonderful day to meet you both. The birds are singing, the flowers are blooming, and love is in the air. But wait, I must ask you a question. Answer wisely, as it'll speak volumes about your character. What's your favorite kind of flower? Rose. Uh, anything colorful. Answered like a true forester, flowers are a huge part of our identity. Nothing <laughs> brings, us, brings us joy more than picking them and frolicking in the fields. Are you visiting family here or something? Or maybe a distant relative? Well now, I think I know you better than I know myself. My grandpa always said that feelings about flowers will tell you more that, about people than anyone else. Welcome to the forest. I hope you have a better idea of our herd now. Appreciating nature, splashing in the stream, taking life easy. That's what being a forester is about. And I love that. I wish I could drop everything and give you a tour of the entire village, but I have my hooves full with these two. You know now that we are not the only herd in this forest. There are two more herds, with the mystics and the warriors. The mystics sound nice. You've already had a taste of the warriors when you met Ash, but it would be good for you to make a proper introduction to the other herds. Okay. I'm kind of scared to see the warriors. Oh, okay, we're doing the mystics first. By the light of the sentinel, a new face walks upon our sacred soil. The mystics welcome you. Thank you. Are there mermaid horses here? If so, then I love the mystics now. I know your names. I have seen it. In the light of Aideen, bless me with the visions of your arrivals. Oh, so you've been like watching me pee and stuff? That's not good. Woo! I want this. Look how pretty. Snort, the look on your face. You thought I was psychic or something, didn't you? No, I just have the eyes of a cult. The ears of one, too. And some squirrels let me know what's going on around here. Oh, so the squirrels are spying on me in the toilet, huh? What are these noises you're making? I am the oldest of the mystics and almost the oldest horse in this forest. Crabapple beat me by three days, but I am far by the wisest. 
I ensure that the mystics keep our values in interact. Don't lose sight, unlike the other herds in this forest. At the core of our herd is the sentinel tree, the giant life warden in the heart of wild woods. When Aiden so planted the sentinel a long time- ah! She's playing your Pac-Man. Oh god, someone's coming. Oh! Why do you sound like dad? <laughs> I don't know. Oh god, oh! someone's coming. <laughs> I'm not coming down. No way. Not even for Hazel that say we'll fall for it again. <laughs> Mom doesn't think I'm a squirrel, but she's wrong. But Mom says we've only had one human who came to visit us. That makes you the second. Who's the first? Are you dressing up as a human and all that fabric? You look just like one. Yep, she's cosplaying as a human. Whoa, are there squirrel costumes too? If you could get me one, please, oh please. Then everyone would see who I really am. Feel the burn. And breathe, stretch, bow into downward facing squirrel. They really like squirrels here. Have you come to join our grounding exercises? We stretch every day to bring our bodies closer to Aideen. Tell me, new spirit, why have you journeyed to our sacred forest? I Um, I'm seeking adventure. I'm always looking for adventure. Adventure here? I'm afraid you come to the wrong place. Nothing ever happens here. The towering sentinel protects us all from danger and strife. Well, adventure doesn't mean danger. It just means having fun and... Learn new things, cause this is the Jeep time, I guess, apparently. Oh, this one's so pretty. <gasps> its name is Willow. My name is Willow, and your new friends came to visit us from the outside. It's a pleasure to come cross paths with you, Snow Rose and Annabelle. I was just sky gazing. The sky speak to sp <laughs> speaks to us, you know. Clouds or stars, there's always a message for us to decipher. The mystics have been looking to the skies for answers for a long, long time. When you look up, what do you see? Dead planets? That's violent. Whoever answered with that, you need some mental help. Stop it. Get some help. My destiny. You see it too? The stars really speak to you? I've spent my whole life looking up to the sky for answers, and if I tried hard enough, I could always find them. I know that someone else feels the same. Willow is like a really spiritual woman. Uh, to the sentinel tree, it was destroyed. <gasps> was it destroyed by Ariel? Probably. Ariel, you Ariel! <laughs> These will do perfectly. Uh, by the way, there was a toenail in there. Not good. I don't think there was a toenail. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the bottom of our sentinel sentinel roof. <laughs> I wish my best luck on your adventures to meet the final herd, the warriors. Oh God, I'm scared. Are they gonna beat me up? If they do, at least do it fancy. <laughs> That's what I care about. If you're gonna beat me up, do it fancy. I don't know why anytime someone's like, I'm gonna kill you, I'm like, alright, just do it fancy. <laughs> I'm kinda scared right now. Oh god, this looks like Lion what? King. This looks no! like an elephant thing in Lion King. No, uh, selfie before I die. Warrior guard. HALT! Who goes there? Oh god, oh god, oh god, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. Stop right there, don't come any further, you're in warrior territory. I'm aware, there's bones everywhere. I'm scared. I feel like I'm the only person who's scared of these things. Mm -hmm. State the purpose of your visit, outsider. Um, I'm just a hairless squirrel on horseback. I'm innocent. Ah, it speaks, you fellow horse. You better keep that squirrel in check. All right, you can pass. Oh my God, Rocco? The Never nuke. trust a guy named Rocco. Yeah. Never. Hi, the newcomer has arrived at the warrior's domain. Oh god. Rocco, what are we please, at don't domain? please don't kill me. If there's side on, just bring him in. Oh god, you're going inside my horse. New blood in the wild woods. I'm Rocco. I keep the herd tough and ready for anything. Racing, smashing pot, drumming. Drumming? <laughs> drumming? The only best way to survive. Yeah, drumming. It's Woo! Ash again. Why is Ash always running in? <laughs> the little hairball has come to nose around. What do you even want with us two-legger? Surely there's what's out there in the gray world must be more interesting than this place. So many of us wouldn't have left otherwise. Ash, be polite. Oh, y'all are polite now? Are you putting up a friendly guise to take him off guard, Rocco? Or have you grown to so lax that you can't even tell him outside 
better when they intrude on our territory. Well, I suppose it would be good for you to prove your in intentions to us. Are you up for a challenge? No! I do not like challenges. Well, you're doing it anyway. Great. Right. A green hoof enters the ceremonial let's grounds. Let's see if anyone notices that. Alright, here we go. Mm, let's see. Where's the drum? Let me bang it. Mm. I got it, I got it. Let's channel our inner Todoroki right now. Why do I right feel now. like you would be Yeah. No, oh god, like that's you. a giant drum. Are we gonna jump what on it? Do? No! Excuse me. What do you do? Not everyone. <laughs> Not everyone is named Do. Just you. We have a new champion. Oh, am I a champion just from j mm. jumping on that giant mm. drum? Wow. Look how giant this drum is! Oh my god! Yes. Classic. Clocad. <laughs> Juniper, oh, Alrighty. Juniper, you know Juniper, my favorite. Juniper came asking for you, but I made an. Uh, we usually don't talk outside. Uh, usually the weekly herd meeting. Sneaky Canucks. I had my back turned for two minutes and the flowers disappeared. I'm trying to teach the falls about various plants for our beautiful oh, forest. Okay. You would make the falls yeah, day if you could baby. find out where. Yeah, the tongue. What, where's my? Annabelle and Snow Rose. It's not what it looks <gasps> like. <gasps> Willow, I like you. What? Or maybe it is. Talk about bad first impressions. I didn't want to take the flowers. They seem so sweet. Why did you take? Why did you take them, Willow? You see, our offering shrine has been ruined again. Gifting the sin. Sentinel tree, the bounties of the forest is how we respect it and maintain a strong connection with Aideen. The offering shrine has been rebuilt. I helped Alder collect the replacement offerings. <laughs> it has? Wonderful, thank you, but that doesn't solve the ongoing issue. Somebody keeps destroying our shrines, racing through the our sacred grounds carelessly. Oh, it's the warriors, obviously. It's Woo! Ash again. Why is Ash always running in? All right, here it goes. You've got my back, right, Annabelle? Yes, I do. Rocco, Ash, I'm sure you know why I've come here. The senseless shrines. You're going to ask me to stop destroying them, aren't you? How predictable. Oh, you, so you admit it. The offering shrines are deeply rooted parts of our beliefs as mystics. Without them, we have no way to make offerings to the sentinel tree. It's in a warrior's blood to put their strength to the test. I give up no matter what gets in my way. That's enough, Ash. Don't go there. Oh, so Willow's Ash's sister. I can see it. You may have fooled your two-legged friend and the pet into think you were a real deal, but I can see through your mask. You're no real mystic. You're a sham. Jeez. Enough! This calls for a herd meeting. There's been commotions with the foresters, too. Something about missing flowers. Uh, actually... Welcome, Annabelle and Snow Rose. You're just in time to witness an important part of the herd life in wild woods. This wouldn't be necessary if you didn't so boldly take the flowers in the first place. Willow knew no better. It was the day of the offering and our sentinel shrine was empty. Without our service, our connection to the sentinel could sever. <sighs> okay, I respect that. Rocco, why did your herd destroy the offering shrine? Ash was racing around willy-nilly and crashing to the thing. She's quite the klutz and she's very sorry, right Ash? Ah, so that's what happened. I see. Just a misunderstanding, as usual. It's settled then. Yes, of course, but while we're here, I have a bone to pick with you warriors. This incessant noise of the drums, day and night. We can't think, meditate, or do anything in peace. Listen up, daydreamer. The drumming ceremony is the backbone of the initiation into the warrior's domain. You wouldn't stand a chance. Here we go again. Alright, everyone calm down. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Deal. What's your take on the situation, Annabelle? We rarely get to hear what outsiders think of things. Um... Respecting their offering shrine is very important. If you're in the Mystics area, I would love to sky gaze with you sometime, or watch the tadpoles in the fens. Keep on dreaming, Annabelle. You too. You better not to forget me either. Now that you've passed the initiation ceremony, you gotta check in so I can make sure your skills are up to scratch. Wow, is this the end? Wait, I gotta take a photo before everyone leaves. Yes, I should have got my Yorvik Wild. Okay, if there's more quests, I'll definitely do.